Hello, thanks for tuning in today. Today I just want to talk about some more aspects that have been linked about Halo 5 Guardians multiplayer and uh, other things that are like that. Just other items and such. So in this trailer, that they give you a lot of information away that uh, some people don't see. So of course, it's an arena, as you can tell. And the weapons that you just saw right there, that's a new weapon. Maybe it's the AR updated, but that's just a new up up updated uh, AR. So the weapons as you see they're running in, that's an AR right there. And as they're running in, AR, pistol on the left. So it's just the normal weapons that we've seen in all the other Halos. But then of course it's next gen arena, so it's arena. And that's pro they say new Spartan abilities. That little jetpack thing is probably, um, it's just, there's things about the Spartan that they've updated. It's not theoretically Spartan abilities like, oh, you get to choose armor lock or whatever you want that was really annoying, or jetpack or sprint or whatever. All Spartans get this, so it's even competitive, competitive, competitiveness. And it's 60 frames per second. That's a BR right there. I didn't know if you saw that, but that was a BR. And when it says all new Spartans abilities, every Spartan can do that slam right there. Because the, through many interviews, I've learned that there are... Um, no Spartan abilities, so that's good. Another thing about Halo 5 Guardians, um, through an interview with IGN, they said, uh, that was a question to ask, like, how's the ranking system going to be? And they said that, uh, the ranking system is going to be more like the older Halos. So that's really a good sign. So it, they're really trying to bring the competitiveness out in the Halo 5 multiplayer. That's their plan to bring the competitiveness out. Because Halo Reach and Halo 4 had that system where you could have inheritors that are terrible or high ranks that you're just like they're just terrible because all they do is just play all the time and that's how they get their rank whereas Halo 3 and Halo 2 their ranking system was you earned your skill so that's a really good sign that they let that out and they kind of hinted it they didn't really confirm it but as the hints go along you can kind of give them start doing confirms so Thanks for watching. If you need more information, just leave a comment below. I'll try and answer if you have any questions. And thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And I'm going to try and keep up to date with Halo, giving you more Halo news. Thanks.